You. Announcements. Now. Hey everyone, it is Thursday, October 10th, and uh, Oil TV. Let's get rolling. And now let's go to Classic Club. National Honor Society is looking for its October Character of the Month. This student should be ready, respectful, and safe each day and display good character towards those in school and throughout the community. Do you know someone who's a great leader and always puts others first? Then nominate, the, then nominate them for Character of the Month. Blake forms are available on the two NHS boards, and completed forms can also be turned in there. Nominations are due October 30th, this month, and the winner will be announced on November 1st. The winner will receive a pizza and a soda of their choice from Papa John's. Nominate someone today. Right. Rookie final payment of $35 is due this Friday, October 11th. That's tomorrow. There are people waiting to take your place if you cannot pay for your trip. If you have questions and or concerns, please see Mr. Rasmussen or Sir Scadella. North Fonny Fishing Club. Sign up to be part of the North Fonny Fishing Club. This year promises to be our best year yet, as we have many new events planned for this year. The sign-up sheet is on Mr. Colby's door. No experience needed. That's good for you, Oscar. Oh, Tell a friend, our goal is to have 40 or more members this year. National Honor Society is selling caramel apples during 5th and 6th hour lunches with your choice of sprinkles, graham cracker crumbs, or chopped cashews. For one apple with topping, the cost is $2. For at one apple with two toppings, it's $2.50. We're bringing the little farmer to you with their specialty caramel, so pre-order today. All proceeds go towards the charities National Honor Society donates to. NHS members are reminded to meet in the gym at 2.40 for a bonding day. Have fun with that. Freshman <laughs> boys, it is important that if you are interested in playing basketball that you sign up in the high school office. The count needs to be is needed by tomorrow to determine if there is enough players for a freshman team. Tonight, Varsity Prep Football will play WLA at the OAC at 4.15. I'm gonna redo that one, that was bad. Okay. Tonight, Varsity Prep... Mm. <laughs> Tonight, Varsity Prep Football will play WLA at the OAC at 4.15. Volleyball will travel to Elmira to take on the Lions. Busty Parts at 4.15. Varsity Soccer will hold springs at the OAC for senior night. Cheer on your team and send those seniors out with a home victory. You know? Alright, that wraps up this episode of Oil TV. I'm Oscar Mazenka. And I'm Oscar Arroyo. And Ann Shear, you are still. See you later. Brenda, where do you wear this outfit? I don't know. Sometimes I go to the skate park. Just just to see all the boys can look at me and how fine I look in my new, you know, my new outfit. It doesn't matter. And how do you feel in this outfit? I feel fabulous. I feel way better than what I did before. I was so ratchet. I looked myself in the mirror and I was like, ugh, you are disgusting. Like, wow, it was not my thing at all. Okay, well, let's talk about what's wrong with this outfit. First off, raise your hands. Raise your arms up. Stomach. You shouldn't be able to see your stomach. Put them down. Next. It doesn't match. You don't wear a skirt with a normal everyday shirt. Um, and it's too tight. You need a bigger size that actually fits you. Um, arms. Okay, it fits that. Next, the shoes. You shouldn't be wearing socks and tennies with a skirt. You need some cute flats, wedges, or heels. That does not look good.
Girl, it costs $180. What you talking about? Oh. Yeah, man, like so we're going through some of uh, Brenda's oh, old clothes. And we're going to be throwing the ones that are not fashionable away. What is this? That shirt came from Paul George. No! Really? Really? No. You know what? No. This is just not working. It's not working no. at all. No, no, we're not. So, Brenda, what do you think about us throwing all of your clothes away? I really don't like it. All my clothes are gone now. Now, what am I supposed to wear? So, guys, I found this skirt in her closet today. Do you think this is appropriate to wear to school? Uh, yeah. Uh, no. 